I am Dr. Shishikaran, nephrologist working at Ashoda Hospital, Malakpet, Hyderabad. So one of the important uh, sign of kidney disease is the loss of protein in urine. This can be because of several reasons. One of the important reason is a disease which is originating in the kidney itself. We call this as glomerulonephritis or nephrotic syndromes. This can be because of a variety of illnesses like uh, post-infectious glomerulonephritis or minimal change disease or focal segment of glomerulosclerosis or membranous nephropathy. Sometimes the disease may not be originating in the kidney but it can be a part of a generalized disease like diabetes or hypertension. Even in those situations also there can be a loss of protein in urine. Another reason why protein in urine can be seen is when the patient is on some medications like certain antibiotics or painkillers or medicines which are being used to treat cancers. Even in those conditions, there can be a loss of protein in urine. Some of the genetic diseases which the patient has can also lead to protein in urine. These diseases can be in the form of a polycystic kidney disease or Alport syndrome. Some of the inflammatory conditions or immunological conditions can also lead to loss of protein in urine. These diseases can be in the form of systemic lupus erythematosus, especially in women, or connective tissue disorders like rheumatoid arthritis, or other diseases like sarcoidosis or vasculitis, which go by several names like granulomatous polyangitis or EGPAs or several other of these diseases. So whenever protein is being lost in urine, the next step what we do is to see what sort of protein is being lost in urine. Is it associated along with loss of blood in urine? So for this we do a urine test, sometimes along with this blood test and if necessary a kidney biopsy also. Basing on this we come to a diagnosis of what this disease is and then we can formulate a treatment plan. The treatment can be in the form of general drugs like ACE inhibitors and ARBs or sometimes immunological drugs which are tailored according to the diagnosis.